Calm Academy presents how helper T cells work. Helper T cells are considered the most important cells in adaptive immunity. The adaptive immune system is composed of highly specialized systemic cells and processes that eliminate or prevent pathogen growth. The helper T cells are required for almost all adaptive immune responses because they recognize foreign antigens and secrete substances called cytokines that activate T and B cells. In the first step, antigen receptors on the surface of helper T cells bind to the antigen and the class II MHC molecule. Then, signals are exchanged between the two cells. Once the helper T cell is activated, it proliferates and forms a clone of helper T cells. Once helper T cells detect a virus fragment, they activate and divide. This is called clonal expansion. Some stay as memory cells in order to speed up the reaction in case of a next invasion. The T cells recognize antigens on the surface of a virus infected cell and secrete lymphokines that do the following. Signals from helper T cells initiate activation of B cells, which secrete antibodies in order to neutralize pathogens. This activates T cells that kill infected cells. Signals from helper T cells also initiate activation of killer T cells, which kill infected cells with a protein that ruptures the cell membrane of those cells. Finally, signals from helper T cells stimulate suppressor T cells to slow down immune response once the virus is cleared. Without helper T cells, we cannot defend ourselves even against many common illnesses that are normally harmless. People with AIDS are even more susceptible to common illnesses because of this.